Landing Elias Ricks is huge for LSU, not only because he's the number one cornerback in the 2020 class, it continues that defensive back tradition in Baton Rouge, but because they stole him right out of USC's backyard. He is a kid who is phenomenally talented, and the first thing that stands out about him is just his physical makeup. He's very long, he has long arms, he's physical at the line of scrimmage. For his size, he can turn and run with receivers, and then he closes really well and knocks down passes thrown deep uh, and picks passes off, as has been seen in his junior season. He had eight interceptions on the year, six of them for pick sixes. So that's just an incredible stat line for him in his junior season, um, and I think he's going to really be a special prospect down the line, and that's really probably the biggest reason why he picked LSU. He knows full well the defensive back tradition in Baton Rouge. He talked about Patrick Peterson, Tyron Matthew, Greedy Williams, all the guys up and down the line that have uh, really excelled at LSU at defensive back. And that's uh, the biggest reason why he picked the Tigers. USC had offered kind of late in the spring, uh, which was late for him. He was very serious about USC as modern day kids tend to be. He looked at Ohio State a lot. But I think when he visited LSU and saw exactly what was going on there, uh, he saw that he could become special, be developed, and uh, he is a phenomenal player who should be great for years in the SEC.